adorable little reindeer is actually painted mostly with the Lunar Blender. Okay, so this brush has a bristle hair mixed with a soft hair, so it gives it a really nice spring, and I use it for dry brushing and making wispy little strokes. Okay, so you're gonna wet the brush first, tap off the excess water, and then we're gonna pick up a little bit of paint and slip slop that every which way. Okay, so that'll give it some texture and make your reindeer look extra fluffy. Okay, so just putting that color in every which way, don't think too much. Gonna go around the ears as well, and then we're gonna pick up a little bit of that darker brown. So colors blend really well when they're wet on wet, so I'm just gonna pick up that darker brown while the raw sienna is still wet and blend that right in. Okay, so the more that you brush back and forth, the more blended it gets and the softer it looks. Okay, so just brushing back and forth and then we're gonna do the same thing on his legs in the front. So we're gonna base coat with that raw sienna and then we're gonna add a little bit of that darker brown along the sides and then just underneath his muzzle. Add that really dark brown just in between and for the back. Okay, and then his hooves are just gonna be that really dark brown. Gonna add a little black just to really make these show up a little better. Okay, so right here. And then I'm gonna add some of that dark color inside the ear. So right there and right here. And then we're going to do that lighter brown. It's kind of a cream color. I'm gonna give him a little bit of a little tuft of hair on his head. Okay, and then around his ear a little bit. Should wait for that to dry. Okay, and then on his muzzle, we're gonna make that stand out. Okay, you can go right over top of his smile. Just making it nice and fluffy, wispy. just going to add a little highlight along the sides of the legs and to do that just mix a little bit of raw sienna and toffee together and you're going to slip slap every which way and you can even pull your brush towards the outside edge just to make that little reindeer look nice and fluffy. Okay so again make sure that when you rinse your brush you tap off all the excess water so that the water doesn't thin your paint at all and you get a nice sort of dry brush so very wispy. Add a little bit more highlight on the legs so that those really stand out. Okay, so just a little bit of paint. There's no water in my brush and very wispy strokes. So just every which way back and forth. So they're nice and textured and he looks really fluffy. Okay, again, don't go over um, that shadow underneath his neck though. So you still want a little bit of that showing. And 
then just even brushing a little bit on the hooves here just to give them a little bit of a highlight. It's in my brush, I'm just using the color that's on there. Okay, I'm gonna add just a little bit more highlight in the top of his little head there so his eyes show up really nice. Just with some of that lighter <coughs> color and some white. Again, just slip slapping it in like this. Very wispy. Not too much color on your brush. And then we're going to paint in that nice big nose. looking pretty cute and we're gonna use that really pretty red and the flat brush just to paint in his nose So I got his nose painted. It took a couple coats. You can use your blow dryer in between. And I just penciled on a little face, um, just with a chalk pencil. And then I'm going to paint it in with the, my round brush. Okay, and a little bit of black. little eyelashes okay and then a little sparkle dot with white to bring him to life okay and then we're gonna make this nose really nice and bright so we're gonna use uh, a little bit of that neons by deco art uh, works great for anything that's red just need a tiny little bit okay blend off the excess And you can see how it just makes it pop. Maybe we'll add a little bit of cheek color. So I basically just, um, I rinsed my brush. I took a little tiny bit of that red, got rid of the excess, and you can even wipe it on a paper towel. So there's hardly any on your brush, and then you just basically brush over the surface nice and light to give them a little bit of cheek color. And then of course he's got, Rudolph's got his red nose there. And if you wanna add like a little highlight around it too. That works. Okay, like so. And then this chalk just erases. Or you can wipe it off with a damp cloth. And then, of course, needs a little white dot for highlight on his nose. And let's 
let's add some glitter to his nose. So if you have the red uh, galaxy glitter, you could use that. It's called Red Nebula, or you can just use the Clear Ice Comet and go over top. <laughs> really makes him pop. Like so, so darn cute. For the finishing touches on this little reindeer, I thought I'd add a scarf and a bell and some antlers. And I found these adorable little red plaid socks. And what I did was I cut down the sides of them. So I was able to have a longer piece of fabric that I could tie around. Okay, so basically um, you can just tie that and we'll hot glue on a little bell just to add a little extra. And then I'm also gonna use my glue gun just to glue in a couple of little branches or antlers on the top of his head. Just to finish off, and even some little mini lights through his antlers I thought would be just adorable. So, I hope you guys had fun. Thanks for joining me.